Hey, it's Wednesday, hump day. It's the 12th of September, 2018. Yeah, the pearly whites got work done already today at the VA Dental Clinic. And they were really good until they slopped that fluoride stuff on it. Now it feels like I got sandpaper all over it as it peels off. Makes my coffee taste yucky. But I gotta have my coffee anyhow. So, hope y'all doing well today. Hope for my friends out in the Carolinas and Virginia, you're staying away from the water and get out of there before you get blown all the way to Arizona. We're praying for you. Hey. Smoking a little bit different cigar tonight, today. Thought you might want to hear about it, but we'll get there in a minute. Today is National Chocolate Milkshake Day. Hmm. National Video Game Day. Okay. And National Day of Encouragement Day. Yeah, just like uh, from MASH when they told them they were building the new four-holer latrine. For you that don't know, outhouse. For you don't know, bathroom. The four-holer. And he said the men can encourage each other. <laughs> yeah, some of those sea rations and army food made you a little bit... Uh, let's just say it took a while sometimes. Anyway, National Day of Encouragement. Go out and encourage somebody to do something. Hey, you know, I thought this might be true of me because I've had a couple pictures taken and people kind of told me they didn't know for sure, especially when I didn't have the fedora on and I didn't have my cigar with me. This comes from Charles Dickens. Ah, uh, if only I had bought a cigar with me. Ah, if I'd only brought the cigar with me, this would have established my identity. Ah, if I'd only brought a cigar with me, this would have established my identity. Hey, what do you think? You know who I am now, huh? The blind guy? Dr. Robin, Dr. Gurkha, owner, the boss. Yeah. Now you see it? Now you don't. Two different people. <laughs> well, let me establish my identity. Yeah, you know who it is. Smoking with the blind guy. Anyway, today's awesomely lovely bandit cigar. Huh? Huh? It's the K. Yeah, didn't know that? It's the K. Oh, you still don't know? K by Karen Berger or Berger. B-E-R-G-E-R, -E -E Cigar Maduro Robusto. Yeah. Box pressed and an awesome Habano that has a Maduro wrapper. I get a lot of coffee from this one. I get a lot of cream and fruitiness to it. Uh, uh, I've smoked a couple last night. Uh, it's the coffee bean part of it. Comes in the middle towards the end also. But a sweetness to it. It's a cigar that I think I'm going to keep around and like for a while. Really burns well and evenly. The draw is awesome. And it's a good medium. I, I would say maybe 55, 60, not just straight 50. 
just a hint above the 50 line on 0 to 100 with uh, 100 be knock your socks off and 0 have no flavor and no strength at all. So if you haven't had this, you should go get it, enjoy it. K, yeah, go look it up, talk it up. It's a good one and there's plenty more. You know, I even had somebody tell me there was a little uh, floral sweet tea, tea to it. I'm not getting that, but that doesn't mean everybody doesn't. I get a little bit of earth tones before I lit it up on a cold draw, but that made it good because then I got more of the cream and coffee and all the other good spices that I get in there, the cedar, the fruit. So like I said, it's a good one. You should go try it. Go have a good time with it. Enjoy it. You see, it's a cigar and it's a person. It binds us all together, holds us together as smokers. Brothers and sisters of the leaf, we have something in common. And most of the time, if you see me without a cigar, it's because I'm in somebody's car I can't smoke or some entertainment uh, enclave that doesn't let me smoke or some government building, sometimes. But you see, I normally have a cigar somewhere. If not exactly in my hand, when I'm sitting somewhere, it's sitting right there. Where? Right there. My dentist was impressed because the amount of cigars I smoke, I had no stains. The pearly whites were pearly and she was impressed. So what can I say? I'm impressed by this cigar, I really am. I had my doubts at first, I know where they came from. I have my, sometimes I have with the boutique line, but this is a true boutique line, and it's a very good cigar. The K, Karen Berger, Berger, B-E-R-G-E-R, -E Berger, however you want to pronounce it. But just remember the K. Not the K, just K. And if your shop doesn't have it, demand they get it in, because it's a good one. Very, very, very good cigar. So, like I always say, try it, see if you like it. Doesn't fit everybody's palate, I know, but at least try it. Get out there and get a K today and smoke what you like, like what you smoke, and above all, just kick some ash. <laughs>